Hey guys, it's Brian again. Today we're going to cover linking between pages. Now we've already covered some basic text processing commands and we've covered hyperlinks. So none of this should really look too strange. Just going to make a simple link. Whoops, help if I could spell today. Can't uh, talk and type at the same time apparently. We'll call this page 2 dot html that is a basic link it's going to say page one hard return and then a link to page two let's go ahead and refresh our browser sure enough page one link to page two now when you click this link nothing's gonna go the way you think it will because well we haven't created page two yet so it's saying cannot display page translation it can't find it to save typing, I like to copy and paste. So we're just going to copy this. And in our new file, we will just simply paste this text. We'll call this page 2. And we're going to link back to page 1. Now remember, page 1 is actually named index.html. If you remember back from our first tutorial, the first page in your website should always be named index.htm or index.html. That's how the web server, which we'll cover in another tutorial, actually finds your page. Go ahead and save this, and remember to save it as an HTML file. So now we have got two text files here, index.html and page2.html and there's a link in each one that goes back and forth. So we'll open up our web browser, and click, and suddenly it says page 2. As you can see from the address bar, we are on page 2. You can click to go back to page 1, and here's index.html. I hope that clears up the mystery of how pages link back and forth. When you go to a site like Google and you type in a search and you get a million results and you start clicking links, that's the foundation of how this works. They're just hyperlinks to other sites, other pages. So I hope you found this video entertaining and educational, and uh, stay tuned for the next one.